Here's one of my old engines that I never have shown off. It's a Kohler late plant, four-cylinder, Model L. Pretty old, I don't know just how old, but it's marked U.S. Navy. Not Army, but Navy. Now why the Navy would have needed one, I don't know. I always think of them being on on the boats or on, on the sea. This is 110 volt, but the problem is it's DC. I can run lights on it and electric drills or anything with a universal motor. I use this as a night light. I know it's a bit of an overkill, but it makes a nice night light. Originally this would have been run by a supplied, I should say, by a larger stationary gas tank. Yeah, there is a fuel pump on the other side, but I put a temporary nurse tank on there. I think it's from a Wisconsin. Hand start. Armstrong starter. Nice brass radiator. Starting to smoke a little bit. And when I started it just a few minutes ago, it was leaking from the carburetor, I suspect the float is stuck and I need to take that apart. But not for this demonstration. Here it is from the other side. Got a muffler on there, International Harvester, that I put on. And you can see the fuel pump right there, which I have disabled. It's got a primer on it. The little U-shaped thing is the primer. There's a fuse box on the top that also has a knife switch to control the electricity and on the other side of it, I didn't show you before, is the on and off switch for the engine itself which is magneto spark. Now let's start this little beauty. Here's the on and off switch. Turn the gas on. Oh boy, $4 a gallon too. 